Hola, como están? Hoy nosotros estamos, vamos a trabajar sobre partes de oraciones y oraciones. So I said, hello, how are you guys? Today we're going to be working on parts of sentences and sentences. Um, Vamanos, which means let's go. All right, let's start. Oh, man. All right. Uh, yeah, all right. I'd like to start with the short parts of sentences. Hmm, let's see. All right, we'll start on this one. All right, um, ¿Cuál es la bolsa de María? La bolsa roja o la bolsa azul? Clase Acer Alguien sabe que esta oración significa? And that means this. Does someone know what this sentence means? I think that's what I said. I'm a little... Uh, yeah. <laughs> a little tired, or whatever. <sighs> I think that's what... So, clase. Asir. Alguien sabe que esta oración significa? So, yeah, yeah, that time I know I said... Does someone know what this sentence means? Okay. Yeah, I do. It means, which is the bag of Maria? The red bag or the blue bag? See, si esto is correcto. That is correct, yes. Bien trabajar, good work. All right, um... Let's go over the parts. Question marks means it's a sentence. I mean, sorry, they mean, whoa, I can't even think right now. All right, it's fine though, I'm good. Question marks means it's a question. Qual means which. Qual, which. S means is, S is. La means the, and it's a feminine version, so the next noun that comes after it is a feminine word. So la, the, bolsa means bag, bolsa, bag, de means of, de of, maria means maria, 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 which is the bag of maria, la means the, la, the, and it's feminine, of course. All right, so this is a feminine word here. All right. Uh, bolsa means bag, bolsa bag, roja means red, roja red, o means or, o or, la means the, la the, bolsa means bag, bolsa bag, azul means blue, B azul means blue, which is the bagger of Maria, the red bagger or the blue bag, all right, um, uh, this one's pretty easy. Okay. ¿En qué día es hoy? Clase. ¿Quién sabe que esta oración significa? Who knows what this sentence means? I do. It means what is what day is today? Si esto es correcto. Bien trabajar, bien trabajo, 
Uh, that is correct. Good job. Good work. Good work. Good job. Um, uh, bien. Good. <laughs> question marks means it's a question. K means what? Or it can also mean which. But in this sentence, I, I think it can mean... In this sentence, I think it means what, still. K means what, K what, dia means day, dia day, s means is, s is, oi means to, today, oi means today. K dia, s, oi, what day is today, okay, yeah. All right, we'll do this one because I was just looking at it earlier. I mucho plumas en la mesa del maestro. Clase. Uh, ¿Quién sabe qué esta oración significa? Who knows what the sentence means? Yeah, I do. It means there are a lot of pens on the on the teacher's desk. See, si. bien trabajar, good work. Um, yo estoy feliz. I am happy. Con mi clase, with me class, with my class. All right, ustedes. Estamos Esard Bien Oi So you guys are doing good today uh, um, Hold on Ah, uh, got it. I'm gonna write something down. Okay. Alright, just some notes for me to look up later if I can try to remember to. Okay. But yeah, uh, that was good. Um, let's go over the parts. I means there is, I there is, mucho means much or a, a lot of, mucho means a lot, mucho a lot, plumas means pen, plumas pens, uh, yeah pens, plumas pens, plumas pens, n means in or on, it can mean in or on but on this sentence it means on, alright, n means on and on, la means the, la the, and it's a feminine the, meaning uh, the next following word is going to be feminine. Mesa is a feminine word. Okay. Mesa, desk. Mesa, desk. Del means of the. Del of the. Maestro means teacher. Maestro, teacher. Hay mucho plumas en la mesa del maestro. There are a lot of pens on the teacher's desk. Okay. All right, this next one. I un doctor en del hospital. Clase hacer alguien sabe que esta oración significa? Does someone know what this sentence means? Yeah, I do. It means, is there a doctor in the hospital? Si. Esto is correcto. That is correct. Let's go over the parts quick here. All right. Question marks means it's a, it's a question. All right. I I means there. So 
Since it's a question, it's going to be is there. I means is there. Un means a. Un a. Doctor means doctor. And it's a feminine word, so that's why it's un. All right, doctor. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I said that wrong. All right. It's a masculine word, so that's why it uses un. Masculine word, un. Okay, doctor means doctor. Doctor, doctor. N means in and in. Del means of. Of the. Del means of the. Hospital means hospital. Hospital, hospital. Is there a doctor in the hospital? Actually, that might just be day. It's either day or del, but uh, it basically means is there a doc doctor in the hospital? Yeah, yeah, okay. I'm not sure if that's del or day. Is there a hospital in of the hospital? Sorry, is there a doctor in of hospital? Is there a doctor in of the hospital? Well, yeah, that makes sense. If it, yeah, it means I'm pretty sure it's Dell. So, is there a doctor in of the hospital? So, like a doctor presently in the hospital? Kind of, yeah. Like you're asking if the doctor's in today, sort of, but not using today. Uh, in the sentence, okay, um. All right, now to longer, some longer sentences. Mas largo oraciones, more long sentence is. All right, we'll do this one. Dang it. I try to cover up, cover up words so I'll have to, oh man. I'm not, I'm, I'm refreshed, man. I got some good sleep, so I don't know what this, why it's, I'm yawning or whatever. But, all right, just, I'm good. Just gotta like, I don't know, exercise, uh, take rest. Even if I'm awake, if I'm awake, maybe take rest during the day so that I don't get tired even when I get good sleep at night. Okay. Question marks means it's a question. Can means which. Or sorry, sorry. Let's go over it, how it's pronounced. Can es la persona más fuerte de su familia. Class say... Quien sabe que esta oración significa? Who knows what the sentence means? I do. All right. Uh, que ha sido lo significa? What does it mean? It means which is the most strong person of your family? Right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I just gotta check. Cause su, c, 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 c. Esto is correcto. That is correct. But yeah, I had to check because like a lot of times in these sentences. You have to know like what the sentence. Like, sometimes you'll have a list of sentences and they're all ta uh, talking about one story. So when we have the word Sue here, Sue is a ambiguous word in Spanish and it can mean his, her, their, your. So like, I mean, out of all these, the words in the sentence, that's like the one that one of the ones that's harder to figure out what it means, okay? All right, let's let's do uh, this, the parts. Question marks makes it a question. 
can means who, can, who, as means is, as is, la means the, and it's a feminine word, so the noun that comes after it is it going to be a feminine, la, the, la, the, persona, person, persona, person, mas means most, mas, most, fuerte means strong, fuerte, strong, de means up, day up, su means your, in this sentence, okay, Su your familia means family, familia, family. Quien es la persona más fuerte de su familia, which is, which is the strongest person of your family, okay? All right, this one's good too. Es el perro tan inteligente como el gato. Clase Quien sabe que esta oración significa? Who knows what this sentence means? Hold on. All right. All right. So who knows? Quien sabe? Who knows? I do. It means is the dog as a, is intelligent as the cat. Bien. To acid or to aces. Bien. You did good. All right. Um, I think that's right, but I'll go over it later. But okay. All right. Let's see how it it goes. All right. The parts. Question marks makes it a uh, question. S means is. S is. L means the. L the. Pedo means dog. Pedo dog. Tan means as, tan as. Inteligente means intelligent. Inteligente, intelligent. Como means as, como as. A lot of times when it has tan and then como after a, like a adjective or something, when you have tan and then como, they mean like as, as. Okay, so, and then these words do also mean like, Tan means so, sometimes it means as, sometimes it means. Yeah, there's probably some other stuff, but I, uh, okay. Como means how, like, as. Yeah, so it means those ones. All right, let's go on. Como means as, como as. L means the, el the. Gato means cat, gato, cat. Es el perro tan inteligente como el ca gato. Is the dog as intelligent as the cat? All right, all right. This sentence now. Estas tortas son tan dulces como... Esos pasteles. All right, clase. Uh, Asir, alguien sabe que esta oración significa? Does someone know what the sentence means? Yeah, I do. It means these cakes are as sweet as those pastries. All right, I was just looking, but yeah, I'm gonna use that as a to help. But yeah, that is C si esto is correcto. That is correct. Um, let's show it right here. See, these cakes are as sweet as those pastries. All right, so you could see. But, but, but let's go over the parts. Estas means these. Estas means these. Tortas means cakes. Tortas cakes. Son means are, son are. 
you guys should know this one well by now because <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've done it a lot. Tan means as, tan as, doce is sweet, doce means sweet, como means as, como as, esos means those, esos those, pasteles means pastries, pasteles pastries, estas tortas son, estas tortas son tan doces como esos pasteles, these cakes are as sweet as those pastries. Okay. Alright, uh... Mmm. Este es... No, no, no. Que... Es... Todo la tiempo... Nosotros... Tenemos Oi that is all the time that we have for today. Uh I believe that's right. I'll look it up. I mean I gotta I think that's right. Um Tienen un bien día, have a good day. Yo tengo que ir, I gotta go, uh adios. Which means goodbye, adios, goodbye, okay, I gotta go, bye.